The greatest movie I have ever seen. Hi, doggy. You're my favorite customer. Someone made a game about the, the greatest movie of all time. I like to call it the greatest game of all time. It's, I'm talking, of course, about the room tribute. Hi, doggy. You're my favorite customer. All you need to know is I love that movie more than I love my child, which I don't have. Which I mean, I, I'm not capable of love, is what I'm trying to say here. Uh, I did not hit her. It's not true. It's bullshit. I did not hit her. I did not. Oh, hi, Mark. There's gonna be a ton of references, so, uh, just... You're not gonna get any of it. Oh. I've been waiting so long to play this game. I'm so excited. The music is beautiful. That's Tommy. Why is he a statue? What is he doing? What a beaut- <laughs> I can't do Tommy. What a beautiful day. I love his face. Whoa. Was that an earthquake, Lisa? <laughs> hey, it's Greg! Holy crap, Johnny. Did you feel that? Oh, hi, Mark. Yes, I did. <laughs> this is very bad. The bridge just collapsed right behind me. Are you okay, Mark? Yeah, Johnny. Just very shaken up. Oh my god, it's Granny! Hello, boys! Are you alright? Oh, hi, Claudette! Yes, we are fine. Is Lisa okay? <laughs> yes, Lisa is fine, but a bit shaken up. I better get home and, co and comfortable with her. <laughs> now, Johnny, as my future son-in-law, I expect you to provide for Lisa. Oh yeah, she always refers to him as future son-in-law. Or future wife or whatever. Doesn't matter. Why am I... Lisa has been eyeing up a red dress at the dress shop. Wait, is this... Is this the prequel to the room? Now would you be perf... Now would be the perfect time to give her a gift. Okay, Claudette, whatever you say. Love is blunt. I'm very... I'm very busy, so I gotta run. See you guys later. Greg is always very busy, and it's never explained why and what he does that is so busy. I'm eating Shirley for coffee, so I need to run as well. Need a ride? Sure. Great. Thought it was busy, but I guess guess he wasn't so busy after all. Look at Tommy. He's so beautiful. I love him so much. I better get moving. All right, where do we go? Okay, where do we go then? I haven't played a point-and-click game in so long. Okay, let's go here. Oh my god, the bridge! Where is Spider-Man when you need him? Where do I go? How can you buy a dress when love is blind? Hey! Alright, let's go here. Yes! <laughs> it's the bug. Oh my god. Hi, doggy. You're my favorite customer. Hi, Johnny. Hi, Johnny. Sorry your tuxedo isn't ready for yet. I was actually thinking I might buy a dress for my Lisa. That Lisa is one lucky girl. <laughs> it's perfect. This game is perfect. Hi, doggy. <laughs> How are you, doggy? <laughs> it's not even funny. I'm just... <laughs> okay, let's pick up a red dress. That one? Yes! Holy shit, Tommy is rich. Johnny, whatever his name. Thank you, you're my favorite customer. Alright, we got the dress. Let's keep going. Hey, we're at the house! They weren't allowed to film here, I remember. They just took someone's random guy's house. It's beautiful. That's how you shoot in LA. Or San Francisco. Oh, hi, Johnny. It says it there just so he wouldn't remember the- forget the line. To the roof! Oh my god, I can't wait to go to the roof. Lisa, she looks so beautiful. Let's give her the red dress. Here we go. Oh my god! <laughs> wow, you look so sexy, Lisa. Isn't it fabulous? Oh my god. I would do anything for my girl. Oh, hey guys. Yeah! Danny! Oh, hi, Danny. Wow, look at you. <laughs> oh my god. It's from Johnny. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Oh, I'm sorry. I realize this it's not making any sense at all if you haven't if you haven't seen the movie. Or at least my other video. How much was it? 
Danny, don't ask a question like that. Nice to see you, Danny. I'm gonna take a nap. Can I go upstairs too? <laughs> Danny, I think I'm gonna join him. <laughs> join Lisa for nap time. Great, I can't wait. Are the spoons here? There's the spoon, thank God. Spoon! <laughs> I don't have any calls to make. Oh, yes. I forgot about the tape recorder. He records all these fucking tapes. It's it's the most MacGyver move of, in the whole movie, I gotta say. Maybe. Actually, I don't know. All right, let's go upstairs. Whoa. Oh, it's the music! Yes! <laughs> Oh, it's beautiful. I tear up every time I hear it. It's amazing. Whoa, whoa, Johnny, Johnny, Johnny! It's possessed by Satan! It is explained early without you. I totally know the lyrics, yeah. Oh, he looks good. Tommy Wiseau always wear two belts as well. I wonder if there's a two belt option. Thing I wouldn't do for you. You are my lover, my dream come true. Ooh. This should be the national anthem of this channel. Way of a bullet, I will run through the forest of flame. I'm hot smooch. Danny, do you have something else to do? I just like to watch you guys. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, Danny, Danny boy. I get it. You guys want to be alone. That's the idea. How old is Danny supposed to be? I never understood that. Bye, lovebirds. Bye, Danny. <laughs> <laughs> I love how they made Danny's forehead fucking humongous. Oh my god. Oh my god. The pecs. <laughs> I better get to work. But where is work? What is his job? I don't know his job. I don't know. Bank? Oh, he works at the bank. Of course. Of course. My bad. Great news, Johnny. We put your ideas to work and the bank is making lots of money. <laughs> They're not going to give him a promotion, though. That is great. I kept my promotion. Sorry, Johnny. Not yet. But I'm saving you lots of money. <laughs> Just a few more weeks, Johnny. You're our favorite employee. <laughs> oh, this is beautiful. Amazing. Granny! So, did you get your promotion? Are you making more money yet? Sorry, Claudette. No, they say a few more weeks. If you're going to be my son-in-law, my future son-in-law, I mean, my son, you will need to buy a house. I know, Claudette. Well, don't go home empty-handed. At least get Lisa some flowers before you break the news. I always wonder. This game fills out all the gaps from the movie. It really does in such a, such a wonderful way. And the, the granny's face is so, so beautiful. I feel bad for Granny. There's, there's a story that. She had to go to the hospital while shooting the scene because they wouldn't get air conditioning in the house. Uh, I, I don't know. Hey, it's a flower shop! What the fuck? Is it gonna be the same lady? Yes! Yes, it is! <laughs> oh, man. A dozen red roses, please. Can I have- Oh, can I have a dozen red roses, please? Oh, hi, Johnny. I didn't know it was you. Here, here you go. That's me. How much is it? That it'll be fifteen eighty dollars. Here you go. Keep the change. You're my favorite customer. Thanks a lot. Bye. Oh hi, doggy. <laughs> All right, we got a dozen red roses. Let's go to Lisa and break the news that the computer and she will tell us that the computer business is very competitive. Oh hi, hi Johnny. Here you go, a dozen red roses. These are for you. Thanks. 
Thanks, honey. They're beautiful. Hi, babe. These are for you. Thanks, honey. They're beautiful. You didn't get it, did you? You didn't get it, did you? That son of a bitch told me that I would get it within three months. That son of a bitch told me that I would get it in a few months. I saved them bundles. They crazy. I don't think I will ever get it. Johnny, that poor soul. I feel for it. My heart bleeds for you, John. <laughs> they betray me. They didn't keep their promise. They trick me, and I don't care anymore. They betrayed me. They didn't keep their promise. They trick me, and I don't care anymore. Did you tell them how much you saved them? Of course. What do you think? They already put my ideas in the practice. And in the morning, I will run through the forest, the flames. I love how it comes in there. The bank saves money. And they're using me, and I'm their fool. This game has all the best lines. I still love you. No, you don't, Lisa! You lying son of a bitch! Why would you lie about that? At least you have friends. I didn't get any calls today. Because the computer business is very competitive. <laughs> the computer business is too competitive. Do you want me to order a pizza? You already ordered me a pizza, didn't you? Whatever, I don't care. Lisa, perfect girl. You know, whenever I ask Marcia to order me a pizza and she says no, and I said, I ordered, already ordered you pizza, she doesn't even care anymore. <laughs> you think about everything. Well, she didn't think about the computer business being too competitive, did she? Ga you need a drink. What's the matter? You all right? It's just a lapsy promotion. You know what you need? You need a drink. I <laughs> don't drink, you know that. Lisa is so beautiful. The sprites, <laughs> the sprites of Lisa is really turning me on. <laughs> oh my god, I forgot. I have Tommy Wiseau here. <laughs> uh, how can I forget? I'm so stupid. I bought it just for the. God damn it. Tommy, what do you think about the game? <laughs> you must be crazy. I can't drink this. If you love me, you'll drink this. If you love- I'm sorry, I need to stop. You're right. It tastes good. I know I'm right. Don't worry about those fuckers. You're a good man. Drink it. Let's have some fun. <laughs> we have to sample this from the movie. The sound, uh... The sound when he drops the glass, it's, a, it's beautiful. It sounds so real. It feels like I'm in the room. Oh. <laughs> I'm tired. I'm tired. I'm wasted. I love you, darling. Come on, make love to me. <laughs> you, you fucking lazy son of a bitch. <laughs> Come on, you owe me one. I love you, Lisa. I love you, John. Where did it go wrong? Where did it go wrong? I don't understand. <laughs> oh my god, I can't. Don't open your eyes like that again. It's terrible. Oh my god, okay. It's Thursday now. Here we go. Let's go inside. Just a few more weeks, Johnny. That's it. Go home. For fuck's sake. God damn it. You have a rough life, Johnny. I gotta say, it's gotta be tough when when the bank takes your ideas into practice and they make money. And I gotta say, though, to be fair, like Johnny's real backstory of moving to San Francisco, it's pretty, it's pretty inspiring. All right, so I, 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 I admire you. You're my hero. All right. Did you hear that? It sounds like Danny. Oh no, Danny! Oh no, the rooftop! No, Danny, what have you done? No. Danny's place. <laughs> Daddy! Where's my fucking money, Daddy? Where's my money? Yes! <laughs> what? Chris R. Hell yeah. What is happening? <laughs> what? Yes! Uh. What do I do? I throw a bottle? Oh, of course, he throws a water bottle. <laughs> and they always throw footballs. 
Come on, throw the football, please. Ah. We gotta do some damage on Chris. All right. Oh shit, it's shooting Johnny. Johnny's avatar is beautiful. All right, taunt. Yes, I'm such a fucking nerd. I don't give a shit. Glamour. Hell yeah. Fuck, Johnny's not doing too well, I gotta say. All right, we gotta get this bottle throw going. Yes, golden bottle. Hell yeah. Now, Mark, throw that football. Hell yeah! Take that shit, Chris R. We're gonna have to... Yeah, keep taunting him. Fuck. Don't die, Johnny. Yes! Got Chris R. What's going on here? Somebody help! Let's take him to the present! No, the police! Oh, they are actually gonna do it. I always wonder how they're so fast. Yeah, you're going to the police. You're going in, You're going for a very long time, boy. You're going away for a... Where is the police? What the actual fuck? Oh, it's the coffee shop! Yes, here's the police station. Well, if it isn't our old friend Chris R. <laughs> We've been looking for a reason to bust you for years. Take him to prison. He's in jail now. Thanks, Johnny. You're a famous citizen. <laughs> okay. All right. That's amazing. We should go check on Danny. All right. Let's go. Ch let's go check on Danny. You're not my fucking mother. <laughs> <laughs> no, Danny! Danny, are, are you okay, Jenny? I'm okay. Are you okay? I'm okay. What's okay? He's talking, taking drugs. Come on, stop. It was a mistake. A mistake? That he takes drugs? Let's go home. Come on, it's clear. What's clear? I'm gonna call the police. Mom, stop! It was Danny's mistake. Just stop! Let's go. Why did they go? I don't understand. <laughs> Where are they? I don't. Why did you do this? You know better, right? I'm sorry. Why? I'm sorry. You you know better, Jenny. You almost got killed. I'm sorry. It won't happen again. I promise. Danny, you know that Johnny's like your father, and we're your friends. We're gonna help you. Let's go home. Take Danny home. Great. Ah, uh, let's go to Danny. <laughs> Thanks for walking me home, guys. Ah, <laughs> uh, all right. It's the time, time for baby practicing. Oh, hi, Johnny. I need that carpet. I'm gonna call Claudette and make sure she's got home okay. You should take a shower, Johnny. You stink. Okay. All right. We took a shower. We shake that that booty. Johnny has a great ass, I gotta say. It's, it's an amazing ass. You remember my name, Shirley Hamilton. She found a new house and needs money for the down payment. I would help her, but I don't have, but I have my own problems. My jerk brother, Harold, oh my God, Harold, wants me to give me a share, a share of my house. Not to mention, I just found out I definitely have breast cancer. It's so sad. Could you lend, you could have a whole game just based on that. A whole story. Could you lend her the money? That would be an awkward situation. I expected you to be a little bit more generous. And what is this I hear about you hitting Lisa? I did not hit Lisa. I did not. I did not hit her. It's not true. It's bullshit. I did not hit her. I did not. What are you talking about? Lisa told me you got drunk last night and hit her. The rage is building up. I did not hit her. I did not. Don't get so worked up. Go cool off on the roof. Yes. Yes. I did not hit her. It's not true. It's bullshit. I did not hit her. I did not. Oh, hi, Mark. Oh, hey, Johnny. What's up? 
I have a problem with Lisa. She said that I hit her. What? Well, did you? No, I. it's not true. Don't even ask. What's new with you? Well, I just, I'm just sitting up here thinking, you know? I got a question for you. Yeah? <laughs> you think girls like to cheat like guys do? <laughs> what makes you say that? You think girls like to cheat like guys do? What makes you say that? I don't have to worry about that because Alisa is loyal to me. <laughs> it's so sad. <laughs> She's not loyal. Yeah, man. You never know. People are very strange these days. What the fuck does that mean? What does that mean? People are very strange these days. I used to know a girl. She had a dozen guys. One of them found out about it. Beat her up so bad she ended up at a hospital on Guerrero Street. This is a horrible story, and he always goes like, ha 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 One of them found out about it, beat her up so bad she ended up in a hospital on Guerrero Street. <laughs> also, apparently, Johnny lives on Guerrero Street, and he was super pissed about. Sorry, I didn't mean to tell your address, but he was pissed about that being in there. I don't know how he got in there anyway. I'm so happy. You, I have you as my best friend. Oh, it hurts. And I love Lisa so much. Ah, it hurts. Yeah, man. Yeah, you're very lucky. Well, maybe you should have a girl, Mark. Yeah. Yeah, may maybe you're right. Maybe I have one already. I don't know yet. Well, what happened? Remember Betty? That's her name. Betty? Yeah? <laughs> yeah, we don't see each other anymore. You know, she wasn't any good in bed. She was beautiful, but we had too many arguments. That's too bad, my Lisa's great when I can get the... Oh man, I just can't figure women out. Sometimes they're just too smart. Sometimes they're just flat out stupid. Other times, they're just evil. <laughs> it seems to me that you're the expert. <laughs> I'm the only one who thinks this is funny. <laughs> no. Definitely not an expert, Johnny. What's bothering you, Mark? Nothing, man. Do you... Do you have some secrets? Forget it! Why don't you tell me? Come on. Forget it, dude. Is it some secret? Come on. I'll talk to you later. Well, whatever. Daddy! And his giant forehead. He's so cute. Look at Daddy. Hey, Johnny. Oh, hi, Danny. <laughs> What's wrong with Mark? <laughs> <laughs> He's cranky today. Girl trouble, I guess. What's new with you? Not much. Still going to the movie tonight? Oh, sure, we are. What movie? What kind of movie are we gonna see? Don't plan it out too much. It may not come out right. All right, let's toss the ball around. Please, please, please let me toss the ball with Danny. Yes! Yes! <laughs> I gotta tell you something. Oh shit! I... So we gotta. I don't know why they did all the dialogue with these throws. Shoot, Danny. It's about Lisa. Ah. Oh. So Danny first says he loves Lisa. She's beautiful. She looks great in a red dress. I think I'm in love with her. So she sa he says he's in love with her. Go on. I know she doesn't like me because sometimes she's mean to me. But sometimes when I'm around her, I feel like I want to kiss her and tell her that I love her. I don't know, I'm just confused, Danny. Don't worry about don't worry about that. Lisa loves you too, as a person, as a human being, as a friend. You know, people don't have to say it. You know, people don't have to say it. They can feel it. You, you can, can love, love someone, someone deep, deep inside, inside your heart. They're, you're dropping so much knowledge right now, man. I feel inspired to write my own book about myself. Inside your heart, there is nothing wrong with it. If a lot, a lot of people, people, people love each other, the world, will the world be would be place. a better place to live. Lisa's your future wife, Danny. Don't worry about it. You're a part of our family, and we love you very much. We will help you in any time, and Lisa loves you too. As a friend, you are sort of like her son. You mean you're not upset with me? 
No, because I trust you and I trust Lisa. What about Elizabeth, huh? Well, I great. He loves Elizabeth now. He loves Elizabeth. Good old, good old Elizabeth. When I graduate from college, get a good job, I'm gonna marry her and have kids with her. That's the idea. You're right. Thanks for paying my tuition. <laughs> You're very welcome, Danny. And do keep in mind, if you have any problems, talk to me. I will help you. Awesome. Thanks, Johnny. Let's go eat, huh? Come on, let's go. I'm starving. I love them. I love them like they were my own child. At least Danny. Danny is definitely my son. Are we actually gonna go and eat? At the coffee shop, maybe? That would make sense. I don't know. We can go here as well. Probably here, then. Why so street? Nice. Electronic store. Oh, yeah, there's a back alley. Okay. Uh, Alright, we're doing, going to the coffee shop, then. Apparently, he owns this building in the movie. I'm not sure if that's correct or not. But, uh, let's talk to them. Hi, Johnny. What can I get for you? <laughs> We're not getting the cheesecake. Nah, not the cheesecake. I kind of want to pick... The okay. You're our billionth cheesecake, sir. I know I could count on you, Danny. So, Danny, how's the cheesecake? It's amazing, Johnny. You should try some. No, thanks. Too late anyway. Just ate it all. Thanks for paying my cheesecake, Johnny. I guess I should be getting home. Uh, this is too much for me, man. I hope you're still watching, honestly, because this I'm loving this so much. Hello. Oh shit, it's them. They've been talking now. I heard you. What secret? It's between us women. <laughs> oh Jesus Christ, her face. Did you get a new dress? Uh, well, I bet. Rude. We'll just talk to you guys later. Excuse me. Lisa, remember what I told you. You, you feel it in Johnny's perspective or Tom, because he's so oblivious. He doesn't know the sad truth of the reality. What's she talking about? It's girl talk. I just told you that. See, she's so angry now. I never hit you. <laughs> you shouldn't have any secrets from me. I am your future husband. Your future husband. You sure about that? Maybe I'll change my mind. Lisa! Don't talk like that. What do you mean? What do you think? Women change their minds all the time. <laughs> <laughs> you must be kidding, aren't you? Women change their minds all the time. <laughs> you must be kidding, aren't you? Look, I don't want to talk about it. I'm going to go upstairs, wash up, and go to bed. Oh! The rage is building up! How dare you talk to me like that? You should tell me everything. I can't talk right now. Why, Lisa? Why is that? Please talk to me, please. You are part of my life. You are everything. I could not go on without you, Lisa. You're scaring me. You're lying. I never hit you. You're tearing me apart, Lisa. <laughs> yes. Yes! Why are you so hysterical? Do you understand life? I love that line. Do you? Do you understand life? Do you? Do you understand life? Do you? Don't worry about it. Everything will be- Don't worry about it. Everything will be alright. You drive me crazy. Good night, Johnny. Don't worry about- it. Don't worry about it. I still love you. Good night, Lisa. It's Saturday. Oh my god, it's the alley! Yes! Hey Johnny, what's going on? Oh, hi Mike. What's new? Actually, Johnny, I've got a little bit of a tragedy. It's this guy. I I'm acting right now. See by the expressions on my face, I am doing acting. Uh-huh. Me and Michelle, we were making out and out uh, at your place. <laughs> now, actually, he's a bit asleep during this scene. <laughs> 
You must be crazy. And uh, Lisa and Claudette sort of uh, walked in on us uh, in the middle of uh, walked in on it. <laughs> That's not the end of the story. Go on. Go on, I'm listening. Go on. I'm definitely listening. Oh, go, go on, I'm listening. <laughs> Okay, we're going at it, and uh, I'm gonna try and get there as fast as possible, and well, you know, I get in my pants, and I get my shirt, and I get out of there. And then about halfway down the stairs, I realize I'm misplaced. I have forgotten something. <laughs> Alright, my, me underwears. <laughs> so I, you know, I come back to get it, you know, and I pretend that I need a book. You know, I, like I'm looking for my book. And I reach in to put underwear in my pocket and sort of slide out real quick. Well, Claudette saw it, stick it in my pocket. She pulls it out and she's uh, showing everybody me underwears. <laughs> you must be kidding. <laughs> underwear, I get the picture. Yeah, I don't know what to do. That's life. That's life. That's life. That's life. That's life. That's life. Oh, hi, Danny. You guys want to play some football? Do these Is this how you play football? Do you just toss the ball around or is there anything else involving in the football play? I gotta go see my challenge a little better. I make out whatever. Oh, psh, come on. Come on, Mike. Let's do it. Come on. All right, whatever. Let's go for it. I'm going out. What? Yes! Yeah, sorry you had to see that. I'm not sorry. Oh! Yes! Alright, now we get the throw. Fuck, I'm so bad at throwing. This is beautiful. Let's throw it to me, goddammit! Go, Johnny! Yes! Amazing catch! Let's let's see if I can get your fucking throw down. I, I don't know why I struggle so much with the goddamn throw. Ah! Got it. There it is. <laughs> Be careful. Hey, Danny, what's up? What's up, Mark? Oh, hi, Mark. What's going on, man? Not too much. What about you guys? We're just telling you. He was just telling us about the underwear she has. Dude, don't. Underwear? What's that? Dude, it's uh, it's embarrassing. Man, I don't want to get into it. Underwear, man. Come on. Underwear, man. Underwear, man. Come on. <laughs> Amazing. Total KO. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Johnny. Underwear, man. Come on. Oh, come on. You okay? You okay? Are you all right? Are you okay? Yeah? Are you sure? Uh-huh. <laughs> Wanna go see a doctor? No, I'm good. I'm alright. I'm fine. I'm gonna take him home. Mark, why don't you take him home? And Mike, listen. If you need anything, anytime, call me, alright? Okay. See you guys. See you guys. He's not my husband. <gasps> He's in the staircase! No! I know my Johnny is part of our family. Mom, I don't love Johnny anymore. I don't even like him. <sighs> I had sex with him. Don't listen. Don't listen. No. You can't be serious. You don't understand. Who is it? I don't want to talk about it. You don't want to talk about it. Then why did you bring it up in the first place? Good question. I don't know. You don't know. If you think I'm tired today, wait till you see me tomorrow. Coming to the party? Sure, I suppose so. I will show them. How can they say this about me? I don't believe it. I show them. I show them. I will record everything. Record everything! Record everything! That is that not is that not where you're supposed to record? I guess we gotta go upstairs first. Oh, here's the phone. No. Oh, oh, here's the cassette. Where's this tape? Where's the cassette tape? 
What do I do? How do I record it? This should be obvious. What's happening? How do you record everything? You look so creepy behind there, dude. This should be obvious. Record everything! How do I record everything? Doesn't he go upstairs and get like a... <laughs> it's in a drawer, isn't it? I actually don't know what to do here. Alright, Tommy. <laughs> I did not cheat. I did not. Uh, but I uh, did look up. Because, uh, of course, I'm stupid. There's uh, the electronics store that we have to go to. Obvious. Tape recorder on sale. Great. Hi, doggy. Hey, Johnny. Recorders are on sale this week. They let you record everything. <laughs> Oh, yes. I never know when I may need to record things. Thanks, Johnny. You're my favorite customer. Johnny is such a great customer. Johnny is such a great everything. All right, time to record everything. It's not like he just heard them anyway. Why would he need to record them? You already proved whatever. All right, what? It doesn't. Let's grab this and put it there. I record everything. Oh, hi, Peter. Oh, Peter! Hi, Johnny! I don't understand women. Do you, Peter? What man does? I don't understand women. Do you, Peter? So Peter's supposed to be a psychologist. And then literally a minute later, he's like, Don't be a psychologist with me. What man does? What's the problem? They never say what they mean, and they always play games. Okay, um, what do you mean? I have a serious problem with Lisa. Um, I don't think she's faithful to me. In fact, I know she isn't. Lisa, are you sure? Yeah, I'm sure. I overheard a conversation between Lisa and her mother. What should I do, Peter? This is Lisa we're talking about. Yeah. I don't know what to say. What are you, psychologist? <laughs> do you have some advice? <laughs> But you're so, oh yeah, but you are a psychologist. Do you have some advice? It's a complicated situation, Johnny. I mean, you're my friend and I don't, I don't get between you and Lisa. But look, if you want to, you should confront her. I can't confront her. I want to give her a second chance. After all, she's my future wife. You know what they say, love is blind. You know what they say, love is blind. Yes, knowledge. Well, you know what? You got a lot of faith in Lisa. Sometimes life gets complicated. And the unexpected can happen. When it does, we just gotta deal with it. Did you hear the door? Yeah. Oh, hi, Mark. Oh, hey, Johnny. Hey, Peter. We're just talking about women. Women. Women, man. They just confuse me. I have a girl, but she's married. <gasps> <laughs> I mean, she's very attractive. It's just, it's driving me crazy. Why didn't you mention this before? Is it anyone I know? Nah, man, you don't know her. Can I meet her? Oh, Tommy or Johnny. No. Oh, I don't think so. It's an awkward situation. You can say that again. I mean, she's too old for you. For you. you mean she's too old or you think I would take her away from me? Hehe. <laughs> huh, nah. I have my own problems. Tell me about your problems, Johnny. Peter, you always play psychologist with us! I have my own problems. Tell me about your problems, Johnny. Peter, you always play psychologist with us. Lisa is teasing me about whether we are going to get married or not. And we didn't make love in a while. It's been one day. It's been one day. Look, you should tell her about your feelings, okay? You shouldn't hide them. You two have been together forever. You can work out anything as long as you talk. I don't like how he's playing psychologist with us here. I don't know. I don't like him. Not always. People are people. 
sometimes they just can't see their own faults. Yeah, I'm thinking of moving to a bigger place, man. I'm making some good money. What is he doing making some good money? What is he doing? What is his job? Is the computer business not that competitive? Is he a drug dealer? That would actually make a lot of sense if he sells weed or something. Look, you should tell her the truth. I mean, you're doing this for the for your girl, right? <laughs> <laughs> you're right, Peter. Is she do? Is she getting a divorce, Mark? You guys are too much. Hey, are you running Bay to Breakers this year? Oh my God, this fucking part that doesn't add any value to anything. Nah, I'm not doing that this year. Haha, <laughs> chicken, Peter. You're just a little chicken. chicken, 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 chicken. <laughs> <laughs> chicken, Peter, you just a little chicken. Cheep, 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 cheep. Are you calling a chicken? I just don't like all the weirdos. There's too many weirdos there. I, I, I don't mind. Mark, do you remember the one with the the big tits? <laughs> the blonde? No, how about the one with the bridal gown with the sign? <laughs> yeah, can you marry me? <laughs> I thought it would take her up on it. <laughs> I never ate so much. Yeah, the barbecue chicken was delicious, right? It's so cool. You guys prove my point. You're both weird. You guys want to play cards? No, I can't. I expect Lisa any minute. Hey, come on, man. Who's the king of the house? Yeah, you guys got to see what she's like before you get married. Speaking of which, how did you meet Lisa? You never told us. Oh, it's a very interesting story. Oh, that's a very interesting story. Uh, when I moved to San Francisco with two suitcases and I didn't know anyone, I hit the YMCA here with a $2,000 check with I couldn't cash. Why not? Well, because I was an out-of-state bank. Anyway, I was... Oh, shit, sorry. She was so beautiful, and I, I say hi to her. Hi. <laughs> and that's how we met. So what's the interesting part? Well, the interesting part is that on our first date, she paid for dinner. So interesting! Oh my god, there's a kitchen. I need to make a sandwiches for Mark and Peter. What? What? Okay. <laughs> Cute! Why am I... It's okay. Oh, okay. How about a banana? Is it good bananas on the sandwich? Alright, one gets a banana sandwich. I'm in America now. I can put other things in a sandwich. Sorry, I didn't know. Uh, guess we'll... Guess we'll put some more things on this sandwich. I don't know what else to put on it, really. Maybe this little piece of... What am I doing with my life? Okay, are we done with this? <laughs> Hell yeah, that's a Tommy Wiseau approved sandwich. There's a sandwich for Mark, now I'll make- Okay, I guess we'll make another one for Peter for no reason other than filling the gap, the fact that he never made any sandwiches. Uh, so I'm really glad, finally, that we are making the sandwiches to fulfill this movie 100% of what happened with the sandwiches. Now we know. I can go to tell- I can go tell Mark and Peter their sandwiches are ready. <gasps> Where did Peter and Mark go? They had to run. Denny says hi. But I just made them a snack! <gasps> Apparently, they weren't that hungry. By the way, I stopped by the dress shop to check in. Your tux will be ready tomorrow. Oh great, I'm excited to try it on. Let's go to bed. I love the soundtrack so much. It's so beautiful. So the tux shop... Oh wait, sorry, it's the wrong way. Why didn't you tell me? How could you do this? Tuxedo rental and women fashion. That makes sense. Hey, are we the favorite customer? Great news, your tux is ready. Oh, we got it. Hi, Baggy. You're my favorite customer. You need to try your tux on before you leave. Oh, okay. <laughs> Hell yeah, you look good. This tux fix is great. Great, Johnny. And thanks for undressing. And 
Go home. Am I your favorite customer? Yes, I am. Thank you. Oh, this is gonna be the meetup. Everyone's gonna come in. Is the phone upstairs? Hi, Johnny. I saw you on the street and wanted to say that Tux looks great. Oh, hi, Susan. Thanks. You look better than a slice of cheesecake. Oh, thank you. Oh, it's the girl from the shop. You do like cheesecake. Because she kept wanting them to eat cheesecake. Yeah, thanks a lot. Oh, hi, Danny. Danny! Nice talk. You look great. You look really handsome. <laughs> Your wedding picture is going to look great. Oh, thanks. Hey, Peter, come on in. Hi, Peter. You look really good, too. Sit down. Why did they just all go in together? <laughs> yes. Wow. Hey, guys. You like it? Yeah. Danny's got a boner. Yeah, it looks good. You look great. You look like a baby face. You guys want to play some football? In tux? Nah, you got to be kidding. Come on, Mark. Let's do it. I'm up for it. Johnny, ask Peter. Come on, Peter. No, I don't think so. Please. Nope. Come on. Uh. <laughs> okay, fine. Let's go. Let's play in front of the electronics store. Yeah, why did they go there to do it? it? Or is it supposed to be the same building? Doesn't make any sense. Just hit me. No, it's not. It's it's actually no. Uh, you made a mistake here, game. Um, it's supposed to be outside the house, right? Oh yeah, because there clearly they went just somewhere else, and there is an electronic store. I'm sorry. Never mind. I'm wrong. Catch Johnny. Oh my god, not this fucking shit. Again. Yes. I can I cannot do these. It works anyway. He's gonna fall. He's gonna fall. Throw it to me, motherfuckers. It always sends me when he falls. Go. 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 I always love how he falls in a different direction of that what he was running. Like he was running this way, but he falls this. Doesn't matter. That's that's a minor. It's a minor glitch in the matrix. Wait, we gotta take a shower and for fuck's sake. Fine, I'll take a shower. Not a problem. I'm feeling a little lightheaded, guys. I'm gonna go home and lay down. Alright, Peter, enjoy your nap. Why do they all have the tux on? I don't. Alright, see ya, Denny. You wanna meet at the coffee shop tomorrow after work? Sure, Mark. That would be great. All right, see you very soon. I uh, can't wait to have that cheesecake. Thanks for coming. I'm very thirsty. I'm very busy. I'm very thirsty. Why do they have a picture of Tommy? I'm customer of the year again. Nice. Uh, oh, hi, Johnny. What can I get for you? Uh, he. What does he get? He gets a... Large? Oh yeah, he has minty. Man, I'm so tired of girls' games. What happened now, Mark? Relationships never work. Why waste my time? What makes you say that? It's not that easy, Johnny. Well, you should be happy, Mark. Yeah, I know. Life is too short. Oh, thank you, Susan. Here he comes. You're welcome. How about some... Something like cheesecake! How about something like cheesecake? No, uh, that's today. real good. Alright. No, not today. It's really good! Alright. <laughs> oh, the cheesecake. How was work today? Uh, pretty good. We have a new client and the bank will make a lot of money. What client? I cannot tell you, it's confidential. Oh, come on, why not? No, I can't. Anyway, how's your sex life? Anyway, how's your s I 
I love the part where they run because you can feel the chemistry the connection between the characters It's truly there now. Where's the park? I actually don't know I don't think we walk further than this The poli- oh yeah, we did police station Police here it is Lisa Park Special thanks to Johnny our favorite daughter <laughs> donor donate it. Hey Hey, Johnny, how's it going? Good. Throw the ball! Yes! Keep throwing the ball! How am I this fucking bad at throwing the goddamn ball? Hell yeah. You've got to be kidding me. Oh, it's going long! You have got to be kidding me. Are they going to jog now? Catch me, come on. What the fuck? Ah, oh, fuck! I got to catch! I got to catch him! This is just like the movie, guys! Just like the movie! Come on! You, you technically caught him. No! No! Ah, what the hell? Good run, Johnny. See you later. Ah! Surprise! It's your birthday! And you invited all your friends. Such There he is! There's a psychiatrist! Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Oh, wow. Happy birthday to you, Johnny. All right. Uh, thank you. Happy birthday to you. Woo! Thank you. Thanks. Hey, everybody. Let's go outside for some fresh air. Why? I love how they did derp face as well. <gasps> Chris R, what are you doing? <laughs> yeah. Yes. <laughs> now we know. Now we know what happened to the psychiatrist that never showed up at the party. And instead, this other fucking dude showed up. Hell yeah. Hey, everybody. I, I have an announcement. Lisa looks hot tonight. Yes, everyone compliment Lisa of how hot she is. I gotta see if Claudette will give me me underwears back to me. Hey, maybe Lisa needs some help downstairs. Let's go see what's up. Steve needs to keep his stupid comments in his pocket. Steve? Is that the other psychiatrist? Oh yeah, there it is. Thank you, honey. This is a beautiful party. You invited all my friends. Good thinking. Good thinking. You're welcome, darling. You know how much I love you. <laughs> you know, it's getting really hot in here. Why don't we go back? Why do we have to keep going back up and down and... Fine, fine, we're going up. Everyone's going up. Hey, buddy, I have an announcement to make. We're expecting. When? How? What? Why? When? What? Lisa, I have to talk to you. You have to gotta be honest with Johnny. I agree with that. Look, I'm gonna tell him, okay? It's just don't wanna ruin his birthday. When is the baby due? There is no. What? What? What are you talking about? I told him that to make it interesting. What do you mean interesting? You bitch! We're probably you life sucking succubus. We're probably gonna have a baby eventually anyway. You're not gonna tell Johnny, are you? Lisa, are you feeling? Lisa, are you feeling all right? Lisa, are you feeling okay? This is just getting worse and worse. I feel like I'm sitting on an atomic bomb, waiting for it to go off. Oh, uh, that's what they were saying before. Me too, there's no simple solution to this. Don't worry, you guys worry entirely too much about me. Lisa, we're not worried about you, we're worried about Johnny. You don't understand the psychological impact of what you're doing here. He does, because he's a psychiatrist. You're hurting yourself, you're hurting our friendship. I'm not responsible for Johnny, I'm through with that. I'm, cha I'm changing, I have the right, don't I? People are changing all the time. I have to think about my future, what is it to you? 
This is gonna pull us all down. It's gonna shake us up our group of friends. It's gonna destroy our friendship, Lisa. I don't think you Mark really loves you. I don't wanna talk about it. Lisa, you're gonna have to face it. I, for one, am gonna have a hard time forgiving you if you don't. Hey, everybody, let's go inside and eat some cake. It's going down! I'm sorry I couldn't lend your friend money, Claudette. That's all right, darling. I will explain to Shirley that it's an awkward situation. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! Just stop asking me stupid questions. Who the hell do you think you are? Just shut up! What, what are you doing? What are you doing? What's going on here? Psh, you don't really know, do you? Maybe I, maybe I know more than I think you. <laughs> yes! Ah, oh, shit! All right. What do you want from me, huh? Stop it! All right, all right. Okay, Fox. Everything's fine. If I think so, I'm sorry, Mark. I'm sorry, Mike. Yeah, me too. Lisa, can you clean up here? Why? Sh Why does she have to clean up? <laughs> He's going to the kitchen. I need to cool off before I go back out there. Cool up. So basically, they show the same scene twice. Like for some reason, he just goes away. The same thing. I have to cool off. How do I cool off? Ah, oh, that feels nice. I'm ready to go back in. Good call. Good call. Then they're just back again. Like, what are you doing? None of your business. What? What happened? What are you doing? None of your business. Well, he was cooling off. You're my future wife, Lisa. What are you doing, Lisa? Leave her alone, man. She just doesn't want to talk to you. Since when do you give her odd? <laughs> Since Lisa changed her mind about you. Ha! Wake up, man. What planet are you on? I think you should leave right now, Mark. Don't spoil it. We were just having fun. Don't worry about it, man. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Don't touch me, motherfucker. Get out. Stop it. You two are acting like children. You're gonna ruin the party. Son of a bitch! You keep your girl satisfied! She wouldn't come to me! Get out of my house! I kill you! I break every bone in your body! Oh! Yes! It's going down! <laughs> Hell yeah! Uh, throw bottle. Yes! Take that, you piece of shit! Ah, oh, fuck it, it's more damage now. Alright, I'll taunt too. Fuck! Oh! I must win this for Lisa! Fuck! What happens if I run? What happens if I run? Run, Tommy. Run. Lisa will never love you if you quit, for fuck's sake. Okay, then. Well, I'm clearly gonna die. Chip, 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 chip. Why? It's too hard. It's a lot harder than it looks, okay? Calm down. There it is. Damn it! Stop it! I kill you, bastard! You can kill me if you try. You betray me? You're that good. You're just a chicken. Get him! It's the battle of the centuries. It's over, it's over. It's not over. Everybody betray me. I'm fed up with this world. I clean up. Oh, it's crying. I clean up the kitchen, sweetheart, so you don't have to worry about that. He still won't come out of the bathroom. Sweetheart, he's upset. Now, John is a sensible man. He will come out. You will discuss this. Everything is going to be okay. I just think I should be alone with him right now. I understand, sweetheart. I'm gonna go home now. Bye-bye. You call me if you need me. I will. Thanks, Mom. You can come out now, Johnny. She's gone. 
In a few minutes, bitch. You can come out now, Johnny. She's gone. In a few minutes, bitch. I love that line. I love that line. It's so beautiful. Who are you calling a bitch? You and your stupid mother. You and your stupid mother. <laughs> Hi, Mark. I need to talk to you. Don't worry about Johnny. He's just being a big baby. You know I love you very much. But he's recording. I love you. I know he's not worth it. Why don't I come up there and be with you? You got it. I'm on my way. Bye. Who were you talking to? Nobody. We'll see about that. Cause he was recording! Good thing I've been recording everything! <laughs> yes! Cause everyone knows cassette players. They record forever. They got so much storage. Yes! Play that shit, Johnny! Hello? Hi, Mark. I need to talk to you. What's going on? Don't worry about Johnny. He's just being a big baby. Hi, Mark. I need to talk to you. And, and the, the whole conversation is completely different as well. Don't worry about Johnny. He's just being a big baby. You know how much I love you. They're the sparkle in my life. I can't live without you. When did she say that? I love you, you little tramp. How could you do this to me? How could you do this to me? I gave you seven years of my life and you betray me. Let's see what else we have on this tape. No, stop, you little prick. I put up with you for seven years. You think you're an angel? You're just like everybody. I treat you like a princess and you stab me in the back. I love you, I do anything for you just to please you. And now you betray me. How could you love him? How could you love him? How could you love him? Why didn't you just scrape? I don't like him anymore. I know, he's not worth it. Why don't I come up there and be with you? Sure, baby, come up. I want your body. You got it. Everybody betray me. I don't have a friend in the world. What about Denny? What about psychiatrist? What about your employee? I'm, li I'm leaving you, Johnny. Get out. Get out! Get out of my life! Get out! Get out! Get out of my life! Yes! Yes! Why, Lisa? Why? Ah! The rage is building! Ah! Ah! Oh! He's gonna go, Citizen Kane! Yes! Smash the fake fruit! The TV is out the door! Break the glasses! Screw the whole world! Not the spirit spirit! Can we go in the kitchen? We're stuck. Tommy Wiseau Rache. Not the bananas. Not the, what are you doing? Let's go upstairs. He doesn't go in the kitchen. That's right, lamp. That's right, uh, thing. Stupid everything. I love how he randomly has a rock as well. Who has a fucking rock in their house and he just throws it at the window? Ah, it's a shame they didn't do that. Uh, alright, we have the gun. No. No. It's too sad. It's too sad. Why? Why is this happening to me? Why? It's over. God, please forgive me. They they also use Kool-Aid to do the blood, which I really appreciate it. Oh no. Wake up, Johnny, come on. Is he dead? My god, Mark, is he dead? Yes, he's dead. Oh my god. I lost him, but I still have you, right? You don't have me. You'll never have me. You killed him. Mark, we're free to be together. I love you. I love you. Tramp, you killed him. You're the cause of all of this. I don't love you. Get out of my life, you bitch. What's happening? Danny, no! Don't look, Danny. Don't look! Johnny's dead. Wake up, Johnny. Please, it's not right. It's not right. He's in, he's in a better place. LEAVE US! Both of you leave! 
As far as I'm concerned, you can drop off the earth. And that's a promise. Just leave! Both of you! Leave him, alright? Let him be with him! Why, Johnny? Why, Johnny? Why? Why? Who's gonna pay his tuition? Yes! Yes! He's going. He's in higher entity. His soul will go to heaven. Is that a spoon? It's a spoon! <laughs> yes. So tell me, Johnny, what is happening right now? How was your time on Earth? What the fuck? It was enchanting for a moment, but I've had an. I always had my suspicion that you were an alien, but uh, I've had enough of that world. And Lisa, the situation with Lisa was unfortunate. Sadly, we may never understand life. <laughs> Do you understand life? You hands, the handsome one, Mark, my best friend. He questioned what planet you were from. Yes, that is when I knew my time was coming to an end, as all things must. So tell me, Johnny, how many spoons did you find? Looks like you have z Wait, you can collect the spoons? Ah, oh, come on, I missed that. Unfortunately, that won't be enough to activate the machine. No need to sulk, number 86. This is a time of celebration. Indeed it is. Hey! Oh! The room! Inspired by Tommy Weiser. Buy it on DVD. Go ahead and buy it. I'll leave a link to it in, in the description. Tom Pope? Folk made it, sorry. That's awesome. Chris O'Neill! What the hell? I know who these people are. That's amazing. What an amazing game. Honestly, that was so well made. Uh, it was such a blast. I really hope it was fun. Maybe even if... Oh, okay, that's cool. Maybe if you haven't even seen the movie, I hope that was entertaining regardless. It's such a fun game. Oh my god, the pug. Oh, that was beautiful. It did change my life forever. Whew. That was amazing. I'm speechless. That was amazing. Thank you for watching so much. Leave a like if you enjoyed. I really appreciate it. Uh, check out the game. Play it. See if you can find all the spoons. I'll leave a link to the movie and the game. And uh, have a great one. This is, this is so fun. See you guys some breasts.